The downtown Long's Drug Store on Bishop Street has announced it's closing its doors next month. The news comes as a surprise to neighboring business owners who say the store brought plenty of life and foot traffic to the area. Max Rodriguez has more. The last standing Long's Drugs in downtown Honolulu will shut its doors June 10. The pharmacy chain says it's part of a realignment of their national footprint and store reduction. But for neighboring business owners, the store provides a steady stream of foot traffic. Businesses like that uh, will affect the small businesses closing around here. Um, Walgreens was one of the first businesses that closed. Now Long's across the street. It's bad news, you know, for downtown. Rodriguez says he is seeing less petty theft and drug activity around his business, at least during the office hours. Once the sun starts going down, that's when more homeless, more um, stealing, you know, a little bit more looting starts happening at night. Neighboring businesses telling me they are concerned this long location will remain empty for a long time. This retail space right across the street where the Walgreens used to be has been empty for years. A Honolulu appraiser and broker says, in general, it is difficult to attract large retailers to the downtown area. Graffiti and shattered windows on vacant retail spaces do not help. Negotiations take a long time. Uh, and then you have to do your tenant improvement and, sh uh, and you have to redevelop the space for your need. So you're talking about maybe six months to a year if it happened today. So it's going to be a while. Although the owner of a downtown jewelry store says he has noticed a cleanup, he says the neighboring office building turning residential has helped. A lot of improvements right in front of our front door that we used to get. 10, 12 people sleeping here at night, and then they come in in the morning, you have to shoo them away. Anybody who is concerned should join in our weed and seed efforts. You know, I would encourage them to call the Office of Economic Revitalization. The executive center says there are no other tenants in line for the Long's location at this time. Max Rodriguez, KHO1 News, working for Hawaii.